330 Broom Street, New York, New York, 10002. Waiting. Working with words while vultures video volume. Art may imitate life, but a pioneering performance artist is trying to make sure the high cost of living doesn't drive all the artists out of downtown Manhattan. Since she founded it years ago, Arlene Schloss has managed the performance art space and gallery known as A's, located in the heart of Manhattan's Lower East Side. In 1978, Schloss developed her own methods of mixing art forms and established its a performance art workshop designed to encourage experimentation of disparate art forms simultaneously. PAW evolved into A's, where the concept of collaboration still remains a magnet to artists around the world. UFO, it's USA, it's From the days of student guitarists and improvisatory jams of the 1970s, through the analog electronics of the 80s to the digital changes which began in the 90s, there were always collaborations going on between artists of different mediums. One of the collaborative events was A's Wave, a cyber event series which was presented on an offline and featured live music and video, combined with navigable web projections. Understanding? Theatrical talks tell 30, showing somewhat short seconds, reason, questioning, programming, performance. Schloss Pad, Doug A's quickly became the place to be for those in the know. Art superstar Jean Michelle Basquiat, who was a nobody when Schloss first met him, jammed on a keyboard in the back of her loft. Arlene Schloss has turned her Bowery loft into a salon for struggling artists who can crash on one of the four feudants she keeps at her pad or in the two tents she pitched on her balcony. What Schloss is doing harkens back to the days before Soho was called Soho and when Manhattan was a mecca for artists from around the world. Energy feels Incorrigible ifs and ish. At fun, cod, diversified, gin, hick, ink, lob, map, noir, fly, quo, rub, suit, tad, you'd buy when X, yep, zap. Quick root, save time, unit face, will X, miss, yell, zero. N, A, N, D, S, and T, and U. I mean, I always did my dreams and ideas, don't get me wrong. The main thing was it became A's and developed into my ideas and workshops and my performance art workshops were happening at the time and with friends and collaborators, I opened A's. And it became official on October 24th, 1979. It took years to clean up the space and move everything out and do all the construction so that it became livable. To me, it was like a big play. I was really loving it, and it was reminding me of when I was teaching and playing with the kids. And so I felt like it was the perfect venue for me to express myself with all my friends and all the strangers I didn't know and were getting to know. <laughs>
for Shaw, and this was the first thing that we said to you. Another Wednesday at A's, Broom Street, Soho, New York City. 